In this unprecedented times, during this pandemic, many of us have been lucky enough to be able to have some semblance of being able to continue with our lives and continue with our work in the relatively safe environments of our home and offices. Yet, so many of us have been longing to go back to the pre-pandemic state of what we knew as normal. But I can tell you that that is not a wish that many and millions of children had for themselves. Their lives before the pandemic is not a normalcy that they wish to go back to. India has the largest child population in the world, 472 million. And many of them, like adolescent girls, those who come from the poorest families, those who are homeless, faced grave risks even back then. And many of these have unfortunately been amplified due to the pandemic. Without a roof over their heads, missing out on their learning opportunities. Today, poverty has forced them back into child labor and they face heightened risks of malnutrition, of abuse and various forms of violence. A whole generation of children today is at grave risk. But at Save the Children, we maintain hope. We know that while this crisis has brought the world to a standstill in many ways, it has also united us like never before from our staff to our partners who are diligently, relentlessly and carefully working on the ground, we hear many stories of inspiration, of humanity and generosity, of reimagined ways to rebuild lives which have been disrupted by the pandemic. It gives us tremendous courage and a firm belief that when we are together, no child can be left behind. It is time to rewrite the world we live in. It is time to rewrite the world that we will leave behind. And it's about time that we rewrite the world our children will inherit. This new normal provides us an opportunity to do that collectively. And with your support, we will be able to rebuild and reimagine the childhood that children never had, but that they should have been having. So I, Bidisha Pillai, CEO of Save the Children in India, invite you to support us and to help protect a generation of children. Thank you.